Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy, Jeremy Cash, man. And today I want to give you another valuable video, you know, how to grow your Instagram account, okay? Now, there's a lot of things that factor into this, but I'm going to cover a few things today, uh, some of the most important things, okay? So hashtags, okay? Hashtags is very important to automate your business. Now, a lot of people, you know, they may not tell you that, but hashtags is a lot of the reasons why people are actually, you know, getting the results that they're getting on Instagram, okay? So, uh, if you go to, you know, top hashtags, uh, you know, dot com, it gives you the top 100 hashtags, okay? Now, most of the time when you put in a hashtag, people are searching for those hashtags. So, just to give you an example, let's say I put in hashtag make money, all right? People are actually searching for certain hashtags because they're looking for certain things or some, let's say someone was just looking for a, a money picture or a lifestyle picture. So they, you know, typed in this and then they saw and they could actually, you know, take these and use them on for their sale. Um, or if, you know, you see something that you like, you could actually contact these people and have them post your stuff uh, if they have a big enough page. And I'll show you how to do that here in a second. But hashtags, uh, when people are searching things like lifestyle or uh, explorer, okay, you see how many posts it gets a, a day. You know, people are posting, you know, lifestyle, things like that. And so people are actually coming in here and finding the people that they want to follow, and then they'll go and follow them, but they also have automated softwares that does that. Uh, and this is how a lot of people gain, you know, a big following by using the hashtags, okay? So let me go ahead and show you guys here. So all of these is what, you know, I've been using. All right. And as you can see, I use things like food porn is a big uh, hashtag food, uh, food photography, uh, food gasm, entrepreneur life, rich millionaire mindset lit. Uh, and then, you know, just certain ones, certain things, you know, this is me and my wife here. Uh, you know, uh, wealth, rich, explore, goals, travel, millionaire, love, bay, money, cash, happy, lifestyle, engaged, married. You know what I mean? And look at the likes on it. OK, people, you're just automatically going to start getting random likes on your post because people are just going to be uh, searching for all of these hashtags. So you can go through here and, and this hashtag list. OK, and then you could uh, actually, uh, you know, use some of these. All right, these are like top hashtags that everybody's searching for, okay? So you guys definitely want to make sure that you do a lengthy amount of hashtags. Now, uh, there's some people that say, you know, um, well, I didn't do it on that one. I'll show you on the, this video I just posted yesterday. And by the way, uh, videos is great too, and I'll teach you guys about that. Um, you see these three dots, okay? You always want to be able to, you know, put your caption, okay? Then, you know, add three small little periods and then put your hashtags or most people will say, don't put your hashtags up here. Put them in the comments. I mean, it were either way works. I mean, there's no right or wrong way to do it. And they say that because people say your hashtags, but it doesn't even matter at the same. You know what I mean, it, you're going to get likes and stuff regardless. OK, now, um, another important thing is you want to make sure this, you know, is appealing. OK. I put, you know, young self-made entrepreneur, CEO of Team Ride, retired in our 20s, mentor and success coach. OK, you can put, you know, emojis and things like that. Make your profile stand out. Make sure you have a nice picture. You guys already know that kind of stuff. But make sure you put your link here. This is the most important thing. So when you make captions, you and you can say the link it check the link in the bio. OK, that way people can click on your uh, opportunity or whatever it is. OK, this one here. You can see, you know, the 5,000 views, all these hashtags. I doubled up my hashtags on this one. I put them in the um, the comment section, and then I also put them up here. And then uh, if you want to continue to get more and more likes after it dies down, okay, after your post dies down, you could go in, take those hashtags out, and put a new set in, and people will continue to start liking it, commenting on it, and all that good stuff. All right. Uh, another website is hashtagforlikes.co. Uh, they actually break down, um, you know, the categories. They say most popular hashtags on uh, Instagram, of course. And then they can break it down to your more targeted niche. So if you're in photography, you know, artwork, things like that, these will be good for you. 
you know, and it goes down the list. And all you have to do is click copy, and you can go ahead and paste them in your uh, your pictures or whatever. Okay, so mine, I usually come down here to other. And then I'll come down here to, you know, sometimes do quotes. Quotes go really, you know, really good on Instagram, you know, success quotes and things like that. And you can come to work for people who may be looking for work or job. You know, I'm in the make money online. And so I'm looking for those people who are actually typing in these hashtags and things like that. And then I go down here to money, use some of these, you know, money, cash, greens, Benjamins, payday, hundreds, stuff like that. You guys. OK, so you can come through here and, you know, pick out your niche or whatever. And you can make some, you know. Uh, build your Instagram account. Now, now I want to show you guys how you can make money on Instagram. Now, it depends on what niche, okay, that you're in. Because, um, you know, you can start a work from home niche if you like. Uh, work from home moms. They got they got a lot of different pages, okay. Um, and what you could do is, let's see what this one is. This is a girl by the name of Taylor. Okay. See, she has her link and stuff like that. But I wanted, I wanted to see if I could find the work from home mom. Um, let me see here. There it is. Work from home mom hashtag. Okay. And see, these are people who are, you know, uh, building pages around this kind of stuff. Okay. Now I don't know the exact page, uh, but these are people who build, you know, pages around this kind of stuff. See. Okay. Now. Just just let me give you an example. So become an entrepreneur. As you can see, everything he has on here is about money. People are love money. They are attracted to it. They see it. They want it. They want it. You know, what I mean, they they're going to want it. They're going to be interested. And all these pictures are from like Google and all that kind of stuff. Like you can tell because I've saw these pictures a few times. Uh, but. They're building a, a, a page around it, and then they have this. Because if you come to this page and you see all this money, you're going to be like, what the heck is this? And you're just going to be curious and click the link. And if you like what you see on the other side, you're going to buy it. Okay? So people specifically build pages around this kind of stuff. All right? So you can do it with cars. Uh, if you type in hashtag cars, there'll be, a, um, there'll be a, um, a page full of cars. All right? And so what I'm getting at is that if you want to make good money, like a lot of people go to ClickBank, right? Uh, and then they'll, um, so let me go to ClickBank just to show you guys what I mean. All right. You can go to ClickBank or, you know, Warrior Plus or whatever, but mostly ClickBank because I usually have these kind of things here. And they also have like, this is an affiliate site that's absolutely free. You can sign up and start making money with it for free, but you can find, you know, um, you know, work from home surveys for, for moms and things like that. And you can make a, a complete uh, Instagram page based on, you know, uh, survey moms or whatever the business that you picked. OK, you can make an Instagram on that. <clears throat> then you will put your affiliate link inside of the description. OK, you'll put your affiliate link there. I'm trying to click on this page to see if they have an affiliate link. On their page. Oh, I'm already on it. Okay, see, they don't have one. Okay, so they're probably building theirs up and then later on. But you see what I'm saying? People are using the cars uh, and things like that. Um, also, if you want to make your account a business page, I would suggest that you do that. That way people can actually contact you by email or phone. It doesn't show here on mine, but when it shows on my phone. Uh, the people I have my email and then phone. Okay, so uh, people are able to contact me that way. All right, and then um, so what you would do is you would find out, you know, if you did health and fitness uh, Instagram, you could just post nothing but health and fitness. You can come in here, get one of these products. Um, you would just copy and paste the link. OK. And once you do that, uh, you can go ahead and paste that link. See, it'll show you kind of things that you could, that you'll get, you know, 30 days, high school body, things like that. So if you did a lot of health and fitness Instagram account, you could build multiple accounts. OK. And so you would go ahead and get your affiliate link for that. Post it in, um, post your link right here. Shorten it, of course, with Bitly or Google Shorten it. Shorten your link. And then go ahead and just do nothing po nothing but post of, you know, health, fitness, and a wellness, things like that. People are going to click that link, and then once they buy, you made money, okay? And uh, using those hashtags, 
people are gonna come across your page all day long, okay, you guys? I just started this Instagram, like, probably, when did I start this? I don't know if it has a date on here. October the 17th, and I haven't even been on it. I posted this one time, because uh, this is my new Instagram. So I posted these, you know, what, four, what, four to six, seven, eight posts, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, about 14 posts, and I already got this many followers, okay? So just imagine the damage that I'm going to do, uh, you know, with this account here in the next probably two months, I'm trying to grow it to like 10 to 15K. Um, so that's pretty much the basis of Instagram. Hashtags are so important. I mean, you don't have to really, you know, get too into detail. Uh, but I do have another way, <clears throat> another way that you guys can crush it. That's in the paid training. So if you want that, make sure you click the description below, um, and you'll be able to see how you can do that. But uh, last thing is uh, going to influencers' pages, and let's just say I did, you know, hashtag millionaire or something like that. Let's say I did this here. Uh, if I could find somebody who's actually getting good results. Let's try this one. Okay, so just for an example, if you uh, had any type of product or service dealing with real estate or dealing with something like this or anything, if it was make money online or something, you could actually, you know, see they have a nice amount of followers. You can actually contact them. Most people, when they have a lot of followers, they build a price list. Uh, I've done it before just to see what people's prices were. Uh, you can contact them and say, hey, how much, you know, would it cost for me to do a, uh, you know, a post on your wall? And they'll give you their price list. Normally it costs, you know, for the most part, around from anywhere from 250 below. OK, I haven't really found anybody that's above 250. So uh, smaller pages like this, probably, you know, 20, 25 bucks or something like that. OK. Uh, and then, you know, when they get a lot of engagement, people will click on your link and then you could actually swap links out for that, you know, period of time. But that may cost you a little extra. OK. And so you can make a lot of money doing that. And so, as you can see, Instagram is really powerful. OK. You can use it to your advantage, you guys. Uh, hopefully that helps you. If that did help, give you a thumbs up. If you have any other questions, contact me um, and go start killing Instagram today, man. Make sure you post a lot of pictures, post a lot of good content. Uh, if you have a good camera phone, take good pictures. Uh, try to take some of the best pictures that you can, you guys. Uh, interesting pictures. Make your profile look interesting. Mine is going to get a whole lot more interesting here um, really soon. I'm just actually playing around with it. I did this video uh, as well and got a few signups off of this one. Uh, which is one that's already on my Instagram, I mean, my YouTube page, but, you know, posted it, just having fun, living life, uh, you know, with some friends, uh, and then showing that I was getting paid while I was on vacation and having a good time. So, um, stuff like that, guys, just show yourself having fun, enjoying your life, look at other influential people, uh, see what they're doing and, and just copy and paste, man. That's it. Copy successful people and you're, and you're bound to be there one day. Okay. Uh, so. If this helps you, definitely give it a thumbs up, give it a like. And then uh, if you guys want the paid training, you can click in the link below. Uh, some really, really good stuff. You know, some of the top secret stuff that I, I don't really tell anybody about. <laughs> but you got to buy the training to get that. So if that's something you want to do, uh, go ahead and do that. Other than that, I'll be making more videos. So uh, contact me, email me, whatever. All right, peace.